You're, you're going to order that you stay away from the Good Times Hotel. Do you have to go there to get your personal belongings? Okay. All right. So, you, so you're not allowed to go stick, go back there, but you can return there to get your personal belongings. Otherwise, you got to stay away from there. And if you go there to get your personal belongings, I don't know, State, you want to stay away? Order? She, you know, she doesn't live here. I mean, I think that she caused trouble at the hotel. I don't think they want her back there. And I don't think it's too restrictive. All right, so just go there and get your personal belongings. You should go with the police officer, okay? Thank you so much. I would like to thank the staff. They've been very lovely. All right, let me uh, just write this out. I don't know. What, what do you want me to do? You need to just reduce the bond. Do you have money to post the bond? How much is it? I don't know. I was thinking a thousand count one and then five hundred two and three. Okay. That's fine. I might have to, I might have to check. A thousand dollars count an one, five hundred count two, five hundred count three. Judge, would you consider an ROR? I can't do that for this charge, I'm sorry. And the defendant's not from here. So. I can't, I gotta set a bond. It's a two thousand dollar bond. If there's any reason you can't afford to pay a bond, use the free phone at the jail to call the public defender's office and they can readdress this with your division judge. All right. And Your Honor, may I ask one question? Sure. Um, may I? Do I have to stay here in the men's unit still? Yeah, I don't make the rules up there, but they okay. should make a proper accommodation for you. You should be in a separate, a separate area. Can you can, you can contact the um, the bondsman to try and get you out. Miss Corey, do you want to note your file that makes to follow up to make sure if she's able to get hold of a bondsman to bond out? Um, yes, Judge. Um, Miss. Dragon, can I please have your phone number or contact number that once you're out, we can get in touch with you? Yes, ma'am. It's the same one I've had my entire life. Perfect. Thank you. So when you get out, please keep in touch with the public defender's office, and I'll make a note for the attorney to reach out to you soon and see if you can get in touch with the bondsman, okay? Fiona, can you repeat the bond? Sure. It's $1,000 count one for the battery on the law enforcement officer. Count two.